Uh, um, uh, We're gonna talk later, Carl. Yeah. Sorry. I'm, I'm sorry, Pluto. You there's no punch. Of, wow, you're really wobbly, Pluto. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah, I can drive. You, you have a car. Well, it's a Prius. <laughs> it's a Prius. <laughs> All right. Well, well, welcome to the show, Pluto. You know. You've been on the news lately. Uh, um, if, if you haven't heard, you've actually just been demoted as a planet. I remember now. I used to be a planet. I'm, I'm so pissed. I'm so upset. Well, well, I'm sorry. I wouldn't know because I've, I've just seen. I mean, I mean, just think about it. You're a planet, right? You know that feeling yeah. on top of the world. Um, and then I took that away from you. I used to get so many comments. You know, I wouldn't know because I don't get comet tail. Oh, it's hot. Wrap to a thousand degrees, baby. Pluto, you're really wobbling there. You know what? Maybe Carl, maybe we should get one of his uh, friends. One, I, I, uh, I already had one on the line. <clears throat> uh, oh, you do? Who is it? Neptune. Oh, we have Neptune on the line. Okay, uh, Neptune, welcome to the show. Hey, Pluto, buddy, man. Hey, hey, look, you need to calm down. Look, we go. No, I'm okay. No, it's it's all right, Pluto. We we you don't worry about it. To us, you're still a planet. You're still one of the guys. You know? we, we, we all love you. Is he? He looks so small. Shut up. Shut up. What was that, guys? Oh. I said you're looking pretty tall out there on yeah. television, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Look, look, you know, we've been talking. You can come hang out and float around us if you want. You know what? Like, we don't mind. You're one of the gang. Don't invite him. Shut up. Come on. I love you so much. Okay. That's come on. Like, we, we love you, Pluto. Come on. So maybe you should come on. Come on. Pluto, you should. Come on. Come on. Pluto. Come on, buddy. Um, I love you. Okay, great. Come on, Pluto. You, you're. Wow, your breath smells. No, no, look, just kiss me. No, I don't, I don't want to kiss you. You're getting my table wet. I'm sorry. You're, okay, good. I'm go back. Sorry. Go back to your. There you go. Stay there, Pluto. Oh, I'm so sorry. So, you know, I, I'm not feeling so good. Maybe I should go. Yeah, maybe you should go. Carl, could you grab Pluto? Grab Pluto. <laughs> Carl, <clears throat> grab Pluto. <clears throat> Good, good. Grab Pluto and take him home. Moving on. As you all may very well know that Labor Day is upon us, and our very own Kevin Williams has made a small piece dedicated to Labor Day. Run the clip! Good evening. This is Kevin Williams here reporting live in this park for Labor Day weekend. I came here to give you this segment about how Hardworking Americans, they strive to bring food for their families, keep a roof over their heads. Basically, oh, hello. Cut, it. cut it. Hello. There is no more tape. Just go on with it. We'll just edit him out. What you doing here, my friend? Look, we're, we're filming a segment. You can see the camera. You can see I have my microphone and everything. Why don't you just... You know, can you just go away? Give me five minutes to finish filming. You can oh, have the whole part. I just, you know, I was just wondering, did you have a dollar that you can... Lend an old man like me. Yeah, I'll give you a dollar. Here. I'll give you a dollar after we're finished taping, all right? Just go over there, be quiet, and let me... Okay. After this segment, right? You'll yeah, after me... the segment. All right. Five minutes. Striving to bring a warm food, a roof for their children's heads, and basically making this country what it is today. These... All right, cut. Cut. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. No. That's a wrap. What did I say? I said five I get, minutes I, to friggin' finish shooting. All right. I don't have a watch. No, this you know what? Hey. Yeah. No, no, no. You know what? Here. Here's the dollar now. Leave me alone. Hey, Go means... over there. Leave us alone. All right. Let me finish filming this stupid segment so I can get on with my life. That's this is all. This is Claude's cue. You're yeah. a good man, my friend. Good man. Yeah. You look good. So I decided to dedicate a Labor Day poem to these hardworking Americans. Here we go. Glistening sunlight reflecting off dewy petals. Emerald... He's behind me, isn't he? That I am... 
I've just... I just thought that you'd need some backup no, dancers. No, I don't need backup dancers. Please, what did I just tell you? I gave you a dollar. What do I need to do to get you out of this park? All right, I'll get out. I'm going to get out. Good. I Please. will. You're going to whole park to yourself after. I just want you to know that you're standing on where I leave my deeds. Just a word move, of advice. No, move. Good evening. This is Kevin Williams reporting from this park. I came to here to show you the real meaning of Labor Day, to discuss what Labor Day really is to the Excuse people. Me. I just want you to know that that is also the spot where I make love to my ladies. Do you I not worry? Uh, what the? What? No, no, oh my god! Oh, no, no, they were alone! Why do you smell like brew? Oh, get it. Oh, give me my dollar, bro! Oh. Oh. Two, one. Kevin Williams here, and you know, for Labor Day, I would like to just show you a poem I have written to honor the American people. Hey, I'm still alive, you food smelling hobo. You know, that's it. Freaking Dateline wanted me, and I turned him down for Conrado. I, I quit. I'm out of here. I'm done with this. This is full. While you're running away, I'll finish your segment. Where's the mic? Oh, there's the mic. I got it. I just want to say a little poem for you laborer days out there. Warm rays of golden light reflect off dewy petals. Emerald green stains grass tickles your feet. And I... All I can think of is yay for Labor Day. This is Claude signing off. Well, I guess the best part about having a bum on crew is I pay him the same amount as I pay everyone else on crew. Which is not a... <laughs> well, tune in next time.